Are we eating nails for breakfast? Hey guys, it's Aiden from WizKid Science, and today I'll be showing you how you can find iron in your cereal. Iron is an important component of hemoglobin. That's the substance in red blood cells that carries oxygen from your lungs to the rest of your body. Without healthy red blood cells, your body can't get enough oxygen. Your body can get iron from meat, fish, healthy cereals, and even some vegetables like spinach. In just one cup of these cereals, you can find 50% of your recommended daily iron intake. Now let's see if we can use a magnet to find the iron. Start off by measuring two cups of your cereal. This is two scoops of Raisin Bran, and I'm going to be pouring it into this sandwich bag. You can pick out any raisins or large nuts that may be in your cereal. Now you're going to crush up your cereal and fill the bag three quarters full with water. If you think you've put a hole in your bag, make sure to put it in a new bag. We're going to leave our water in the bag for half an hour. So I have my mini wheats and my raisin bran. The mini wheats got really thick, so I had to dump some out and add some more water. Now you're going to put your bag on its side, put the magnet underneath, and swish it around for 15 seconds. One, two, three, four. Now flip your bag over, and you should see some iron filings. Your stomach digests iron and it is later absorbed into the small intestine. If all of the iron in my body was extracted, I'd have enough to make two small nails. A healthy adult needs about 18 milligrams of iron each day. A huge shout out to Steve Spangler and Epic Science for this epic idea. Try this experiment on your own using different cereals. We had fun looking in the cereal aisle for the cereals with the most iron. Shoutouts to all commenters on my last video, CCDIY, AntRox42, Kellen Hartman, Max Toy Magazine, Sanjana DSM, Learn With Miss B, Sawani Jones, Akbar Shazad. Thanks for watching! Click here to watch my last video, Saltwater Density Tower. Make sure to subscribe to my other channels, WizKid Math and WizKid Play. You can find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, WizKidScience. Mission complete. Here's my saltwater density tower. You can also do this experiment with sugar instead of